I'm so bored of crashing my stupid head through the same thing every day. What's the use? You're a crash dummy. That's what you're supposed to do. It's what we're all supposed to do. Not me. I meant to do more. I just know it. So why are you still here then, Big Shot? I... I... could leave if I wanted to. Sure! Whee-hey-hey! <laughs> here we go again. That's it! He's the one! Every day I hear him complaining! Well now we'll see what he's made of! Quick! Bring him in! We don't have much time! Yes, number 12! I know! But I have no other option! Hey! What's happening? I've never done this crash test before! Wait, what are you doing to me? Stop! I didn't mean to complain! I'll do my job properly! I'm sorry! Please! Ready, three, two, one. Setup complete. Whoa! What was that? I feel funny. Different somehow. You are different, Sid. That's why I chose you. Choose me? What for? I often hear you talking to the other dummies about wanting more from life. This is your chance to earn it. Oh, well, what do I have to do? It's too late to change your mind, Sid. I have fitted you with the latest ESS system. ESS system? I don't understand. We don't have time. I'll explain later. Right now, you are the only hope I have of finding my daughter. Your daughter? Yes, she has gone missing. Somewhere near the warehouse, I believe. Great. So all this is just to go back to the boring old warehouse. So much for something different. Professor Workin, my old friend, what have you done to me? We built the ESS system together, but you've been using it for your own selfish gains ever since. Wasting it on that stupid project while I sit here suffering alone? No more. Today, I take back what is rightfully mine. Mr. Madness, round up some dummies. Crusher Robot will fly you to the starting point for this mission. There can be no room for errors. Mission K must be a success, or else... Whatever you say, Detroit, sir. Yes, sir. Ah, dumpers! Detroit should take you out of production. I'll see you in the hangar in five minutes. If that's not too difficult for you, how on earth does Detroit expect me to accomplish this mission with those fools?
these things! You heap of junk! I'll be waiting for you. The things I have to put up for you. the next two doors. Just turn them all on and you shouldn't have any problems. Super! It sounds easy. Surveillance cameras! Be careful not to sound the alarm! How am I supposed to do that? Get close to the wall and enter stealth mode to creep along it without being seen. generator and restore the line. I mean, now, am I?
see that? Professor, there's no sign of your daughter anywhere. I've looked in every corner of the warehouse and nothing, not even a trace of her. Holy transistors! I never thought he would do this. I have underestimated Detroit. He must have taken her to his castle on Mount Rumble. Detroit? Mount Rumble? What are you talking about? Never mind, you must hurry. At the warehouse exit, you will find a crash test car. Use this to get to the hangar. Inside the hangar, there is a secret passage that will take you down to the city sewers. That's the shortest route to Mount Rumble. Ew! I have to go to the smelly sewers? No one ever said being a hero was easy. Yeah, I guess. Besides, 
This will give you a chance to put your crash test driving skills to good use. Destroy the walls that block the way to the hangar and try to get to the end of the track as fast as you can. Walls to destroy? Sounds cool. I feel like I'm in a video game.
Whoa, prof. That thing. Whoa, prof. That thing appeared out of nowhere, and he was very upset. What was it? It was an old make of surveillance robot. I thought they had all been dismantled. Detroit must have recycled it and fitted it with machine guns. I hope we've lost it now. Professor, you're breaking up. I can't hear you properly. The signal down here is getting weaker. I'm being watched. Hurry! laser ammo to blast it. Frozen metal is weaker, so you can destroy it using an ordinary punch attack. I don't have any freezing laser ammo. I believe there is ammo mm, up there. Cool! I'll be able to use this ammo against enemies as well.
I don't think I can swim. Don't panic. I've just upgraded your circuits again. You can now use your swim mode. It looks tiring. Will swimming use up a lot of my stamina? Picking up a stamina bonus will restore your stamina levels. Oh, great! Now I have to swim in sewer water! Be very careful not to touch the underwater mines or they'll explode! Thank <laughs> you. 
Not such a dummy now! Professor, what have you got me into? It looks like a mutant village. Detroit knows all the passages that lead to his base. So he's left some of his evil dummies to stop you. Now you tell me. Hey, Sid, look, I've managed to hack into Detroit's surveillance system and grab some pictures of my poor daughter. She's being held by one of Detroit's junk bots. Hey, you, watch what you're doing. I can still see the dust from over here. Do your job properly. Wow, I'd never seen her before. She really is beautiful, but she looks like a crash test dummy. Professor? What? I can't hear you. The signal is going. Talk to you later. Hmm, that's strange. I could have sworn. Found a secret area. Ah! Not such a dummy now, am I?
You found a secret area.
awful smelling, awful place. Sid, I've been able to capture some images from Detroit's surveillance system. Well, isn't that cute? The professor has sent someone to look for you. Look for me? He's wasting his time. I have no intention of going back to that boring old place. I won't. I won't. I won't. Don't say another word. I'm sick of your whining. I'm finding it increasingly hard to see why anyone would want to rescue you. As for this so-called hero, he doesn't have a clue what he's letting himself in for. <laughs> Nobody has ever made it through Mount Grumble alive. Oh, great. I'm a doomed dummy. Professor? Professor? He's disappeared again. My artificial intelligence tells me there's something strange going on here. Not such a dummy now, am I? Use flamethrower to burn wooden obstacles.
Dummy now, am I? Not such a dummy now, am I? Thank <laughs> you. 
it. This military checkpoint is guarded by Crusher Robot. Be careful. He is armed with a heavy and destructive hammer. The only way to defeat him is to destroy his weapon. Seems I've got off lightly up to now. This ESP... What's it called again? ESS. Whatever, it's so cool!
Ow! My poor head! Please stop! Don't hurt me! I'm not really evil! I'm only doing what my boss tells me! You mean Detroit? Yes, he won me in a poker match against the Professor. The Professor knew it was impossible to beat him but was too proud to admit it. He can't stand to lose and has a knack of making a bad situation even worse. Tell me about it. He sent me into this nightmare to rescue his daughter. His daughter? What do you mean? That's impossible. It's true. I've seen her with my own eyes. Hmm. Listen. You saved my life. In return, I'll give you a ride across the river. It's practically impossible to get across if you can't fly. And if Detroit knows you're coming, it will be heavily protected. Now you're talking. Let's fly! How much further? I'm starting to feel seasick. Here we go, coming in to land. I'm afraid I can only take you this far. Otherwise I'll be in range for Detroit's radar. He has a remote destruct button, so I can't risk going any further. Or I'll end up in the junkyard. Oh, that's fine, thank you. I just want to get down. I've really had enough. Sid, I almost forgot. When you next see the Professor, ask him about the experiment. He'll know what you mean. Experiment? What is this? Some sort of riddle? I really should go now. Good luck. You'll need it. Well, that makes me feel much better. Thanks. What have I got myself into? Oh, great. Now I'm surrounded by dead dummies.
dummy now, am I? Not such a dummy now, am I? Not such a dummy now, am I?
Sid, you made it! I knew you would! You're finally on Mount Rumble, and very close to the castle gates! I wasn't so sure! I guess it's all thanks to your ESS system, and Crusher Robot! He told me to ask you about the experiment. Is there something I should know? I wanted to tell you at the beginning, but I was afraid you wouldn't help me. I lost my daughter in a fatal accident during the ESS prototyping experiment. I used what was left of her DNA and the ESS chip to make a dummy out of her. Kind of like you. It was the only way I could try and get her back. Detroit was my colleague back then, and he tried to help, but was also hurt in the accident. Things are beginning to make sense. Professor, I'm really sorry about what happened to your daughter, but I'll do my best to rescue Mia.
you see that? There is earthquake activity on my radar screen. I don't know where it has come from, but you're not programmed to fight such a monster. I suggest you run!
not so...
not such a dummy now, am I?
I'm surprised you made it this far. You've excelled yourself and the professor. But I think your circuits are about to get overloaded. Do you really think I'm scared of someone with hair like yours? <laughs> How dare you insult me! I'm going to wipe that plastic smile off your face! <laughs>
You found a secret area! Did you see Hed that?
a dummy now, am I?
secret area. I must give the professor some credit. The latest ESS model is impressive. You're the first one to get to the castle unharmed. Detroit, let my daughter go. You still don't get it, do you? You can't bring your real daughter back. I know, believe me, I know. But if there's even a tiny bit of my daughter left in Mia, I need her with me. I'm going to dismantle her and take back what is rightfully mine. The ESS system. I'm warning you, Detroit. Don't harm a single hair, wire or cable on her head. Hold on, Mia. I'm coming.
Sid. I knew you could do it. Mia is safe and sound, back where she belongs. I almost decided to leave her there. She's way too demanding for my liking. You meanie! How can you say something like that? Detroit wanted to take me to pieces and steal my ESS. Perhaps he could have made a nice microwave out of your spare parts. Or a hi-fi, since you're so noisy. I know. I'm sorry. My stupid behavior put us all in danger. You were so brave, though, to rescue me like that. Thank you. Actually, it wasn't my idea. I only did it so I could see life outside the warehouse. It's not all it's cracked up to be. I think I'm going to remove this ESS chip. No, you shouldn't! Sid! Wait a minute! There's nothing there! I'm sorry, Sid! I couldn't send you to Detroit with the latest ESS chip! I was afraid he'd steal that too! That means... I know! I'm sorry! Please don't be angry! Angry? I did it all by myself! I am a hero! I said you were different! We're not such dummies after all! Can we go home now? Yes! I have to tell the others about this! Of course, my children! I'm so proud of you both! Let's go home!